Let me crank up a little bit of heat on this pan. And this is where we're gonna get started with the onion, the garlic, and the shrimp to make the stuffing to go into these little bad boys, the pepadoos. Okay, so let me get started on these right now. This is the last two of the shrimp. Nice having them peeled and deveined, but boy, taking those tails off and cutting them up small enough so they'll go in those pepadoos. There we go. So that goes in with the onions and the garlic. All right, give that a little flip and a little saute. Then I'm gonna deglaze right now, and what is this for? Well, it is gonna be for this really tasty stuffed pepadou. You know, these uh, South African peppers, little spicy, little heat. I'm gonna stuff this shrimp mixture into it. You're gonna love it, okay? Then we're gonna hit a little bit of lemon juice in there. There we are. And just a pat of butter, just a, well, a little more than a pat. You can let that sit down in there and reduce for a second. I'll tell you something, I'm gonna wear this knife out. I tell you, to make great food takes a little bit of extra effort. Well, here goes some parsley, some Italian parsley into this mixture of onions and garlic and shrimp. And they've been cooked and then deglazed with a little white wine and some lemon juice. Let's go ahead and make this vinaigrette. Now what I'm gonna do is make, I said it was gonna be a futon of cabbage. I'm gonna make a nice little vinaigrette with some rice wine vinegar. There we go. A little midden, which is a Japanese cooking wine or Asian cooking wine. You can use white wine if that's what you got. There we go. And a little bit of soy. Just a little touch and some olive oil. Just a nice, like Asian vinaigrette. Okay, whisk that together. My vinaigrette's done. Now I want to get some cabbage. This is just going to be kind of simple. You know, I'm just going to give a nice little julienne on this, kind of shred it up a little bit, put it into the mixture. And this is going to work as my futon o cabbage for these pepadoos. Not real strong with the knife? Go ahead and grab a mandolin. You can find them pretty reasonable these days. But look at that. I love this cabbage, right in there. Okay, toss it a bit. Now it's gonna take a little bit of time in this marinade. It needs to soak some of it up. It's kinda of like making a coleslaw. If you put the dressing on it right off the bat and then put it on a platter, it kinda of runs a bit. So we want this to sit there and kinda of soak some of it up in there. All right. There we go. Now it's time to stuff the pepadoos. Now what are the pepadoos? Well, these great little peppers that come out of South Africa, they're kind of spicy, they're kind of hot, um, but they're kind of sweet at the same time. Find them a lot of time at, at uh, salad bars or olive bars. Now we take this mixture, and we'll give it a little stir. And remember, we've got the, uh, the, the, the shrimp, the onions, the carrots, we deglazed it with white wine, we got some butter, we got some lemon juice, and we just put in some parsley, and we put in some green onions. So you take it like this, Pick up a little spoonful. And you almost kind of have to work together on this when you do it. But you'll take that and stuff it, and then it'll sit up in that cabbage like little gems. Huh, what do you think? 